We are hearing from the woman who was inside the car with Aaron Bailey when he was shot and killed by IMPD last week. In an exclusive interview with RTV6, Shawanda Ward explains what she saw from her point of view as the only witness to what happened that morning. Yeah, good morning, Indiana's Nicole Griffin is on the live desk for us this morning. Nicole, what are you learning? Well, good morning. This is the first time we are getting to hear from Shawanda Ward, who was arrested after that shooting just over a week ago today. Ward was very emotional when we talked with her. The two were in a car together when Aaron Bailey, who was unarmed, was shot by IMPD officers. The police officers are shot and killed him for no apparent reason, just because the airbags hit him in the face. Um, and they thought that he was reaching for a pistol, which he has not. When we talked to Ward last night, she had injuries on her arms from those airbags deploying. On June 29th, around 1.45 a.m., Aaron Bailey, who was driving the car with Ward inside, was pulled over by police for a traffic violation. During that nine-minute stop, Bailey sped from the scene, leading police on a brief chase before crashing into a tree. An altercation then occurred after that crash, and two officers fired multiple rounds at the vehicle, hitting Bailey. He was taken to the hospital, where he later died. Meanwhile, Ward was arrested for a drug paraphernalia charge at the scene of the shooting. She appeared in court this week on unrelated charges. Ward tells us she does plan to get a lawyer to look into this incident. We did reach out to IMPD about Ward's claims and we will let you know what they say as soon as we get a response. But there are currently two separate investigations underway into the shooting. IMPD Chief Brian Roach says the department is working and striving to make changes and not waiting for the process to complete. Those changes will deal with how officer-involved shootings are investigated. Back to you. All right.